Hi, let's solve one previous question of greedy technique. This question was asked in GATE CS 2022, question number 39. Consider a simple undirected weighted graph G, all of which age weight are distinct. Just mark the word distinct. Which of the following statement about the minimum spanning tree of G is or are true? Four options are given. Let's check one by one option. First statement, the age with the second smallest weight is always part of any minimum spanning tree of G. Let's take an example. Now in this graph, we want to find minimum spanning tree. So first we will choose the smallest weight S that is AB. Next we will choose BC, second smallest weight. Next we cannot choose 3 as it is creating cycle. So we will choose CDS weight is 4. By Kruskal algorithm, we will choose the edges according to its increasing weight and by two edges, there will be no cycle. For cycle, we need at least three edges. That's why we always include second smallest weight edge. So option A is true. Next option B, one or both of the edges with the third smallest and the fourth smallest weight are part of the minimum spanning tree of G. This is also true. Here mark, we skip 3 and we include 4. So 3 is the third smallest weight, 4 is the fourth smallest weight. 1 or both. So we include fourth smallest weight and we skip third smallest weight. Suppose this is a graph, then in minimum spanning tree, we will include 1 weight, 2 weight, 3 weight, 4 weight and 5 weight. So here we are including both third smallest weight and fourth smallest weight edge. Option A is true, option B is true. Next option C. Suppose S is subset of B, B such that S not equals to 5 and S not equals to B. B for vertices, S is some set. Consider the edge with the minimum weight such that one of its vertices is in S and other in B minus S. Such an edge will always be part of any minimum spanning tree of G. This is true. I already discussed cot concept during lecture. Now I'll find minimum spanning tree on this graph. So let me include AB edge where it is 1, BC edge where it is 2. So at this step, one part will be in S, another part will be in B minus S. Now this is a cot. And the edges crossing the cot are AD, DC and CE. So here lowest weight is 3. So the minimum weight is that crossing the cot is the lightest edge in minimum spanning tree. Next will include that is that is a safe edge for minimum spanning tree. So option C is true. A light edge is a safe edge and always part of minimum spanning tree. So the edges that crosses the cot from that whichever weight is lowest that is the light edge and that is safe for minimum spanning tree. Next option D. G can have multiple minimum spanning trees. This is false. As you can mark here it is written weights are distinct. When weights are distinct there will be only one minimum spanning tree possible. So this is false. We found option A is true, option B is true, option C is true. So answer will be A, B, C. I already discussed minimum spanning tree. Just go through that. And if this lecture is helpful for you please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.